Communities with millages on the ballot saw the greatest turnout on this year's primary election day. Action News reporter Kim Russell is live in the newsroom with more on this day of results. Kim? Yes, Vic. Here's a look at a few races that really got people voting. In Troy, more than 21,000 people turned out to vote, deciding whether the Troy Library gets another chapter. 58% voted for a millage saving their city's library. City leaders say the library would have closed Friday without the millage. In Garden City, folks learned their vote can really make a difference. Their school millage just barely passed by six votes. Allen Park residents voiced their opinion they don't want to pay more taxes. They voted down a measure that would have raised almost $2 million for the general fund. City leaders say cuts will have to be made to make up for it. And in Livonia, both the senior services and public safety millages passed with 75% of the vote. Again, Action News has you covered with complete election results at WXYZ.com. You can find everything right on the homepage. Live in the newsroom, Kim Russell, Channel 7 Action News.